The Kim vs. Courtney fight continues with the K. I hate to say even continues because this phone call was 818 times worse than the entirety of season three. I have a really hard time picking sides in this fight. I am surprised I'm not fully team Kim, but I say that because the two are fighting about two completely different things. In Kim's eyes, it's only about the Dolce & Gabbana of it all, and that is all Kim can wrap her brain around. Which I don't blame her because Courtney has never been completely honest with her feelings until now. Courtney thinks Kim Kardashian is a selfish witch, egotistical, narcissistic, couldn't be happy for her on her wedding day, that hates when she's not the center of attention. Now, I'm not gonna lie here. This was Keeping Up Courtney that came out. And I'm not sure if Keeping Up Courtney forgot about Keeping Up Kim. Because everything Courtney said gave Kim the green light to go in. Now, I am not saying everything Kim Kardashian said was in the right. But as a viewer, she wasn't wrong. <laughs> not gonna let Kourtney Kardashian come for her, are you kidding me? Should've she brought up the kids? No. Should've she made Kourtney feel bad that her own friends are talking shit about her? No! Should've she proved Kourtney's point right that Kim's not happy for her by saying, well, the only reason I said all these negative things about you was after you said I wasn't happy about you. Probably, probably not. But just when you thought that was the worst, Kim Kardashian saying, are you happy? Like the way Kim said that, I don't blame Kourtney for calling him a witch and that she hates her. Because in that moment, it really was Kourtney Kardashian versus her friends, her family, Family and even her kids. Kim said that my mouth at the floor. Like that is something I would think that wouldn't make the show. But where do we go from here? The fact that it's episode one and we already have the two in a confessional, I thought was a good sign, but watch this clip. Where are you guys at now? Everything's all good. I mean, we're here. Yep. Everything is not all good. In Kim's eyes, yes, Kim's able to move on, but Courtney's look at the end of that video is all the proof I need that Courtney Kardashian is not over. 